Hi, I'm Justin Conway. Today I'm going to talk about how to indent a list of items in uh, Microsoft Word. Um, tons of ways to do this if you wanted to move over pieces of information that are in a list, kind of differentiate them from whatever else you have on your on your page, on your document, um, this would be helpful. You would, you would be able to indent and sort of show the breakdown. Uh, you see this a lot in like contracts and things like that. So I'll, I'll walk through some ways. So right here we have um, a whole bunch of words just uh, laid out. Let's say this is our list. Um, one way to create the indent is simply to grab this. If you have your ruler enabled uh, or you're you know, within your, um, your view options, you have your ruler there, you can just simply grab this and slide it across and then you get an indentation and you can select the lines that you'd like to indent and you can just indent those lines. You can also select within uh, certain sets and just pull them out. That's one way. You can also just tab across. You can just select inside uh, or at the beginning of a sentence, hit tab and that will go across. Um, let's undo that. And then a third way I'll cover quickly is if you want to use uh, bullets or lists um, uh, the listing. So you go into Format, Bullets and Numbering. You can select, let's say we're going to do the numbers here. Um, click OK. You can get some numbers in there. Then you can uh, increase or de uh, decrease your indenting from here using the ruler. Or you can go back in through your Bullets and Numbering and hit the Customize button and you'll be able to increase or decrease your alignment, which you can see they're moving here using these functions here. And that'll enable you to pretty much fully control how much indentation uh, appears on your sheet. So that's basically how to indent um, in different ways in Microsoft Word. My name is Justin Conway. I hope that helped. And uh, enjoy. Thanks.